Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing well. Today I'm going to cover the how to enable multi languages. Let's get started. Log in to your personal development instance. Let's identify our instance is enabled with multi languages or not. How to identify it? So go to the settings icon and see the language. If there are more than one language, then it is multi language. Okay, so click on language and English and Spanish. So I already enabled the Spanish language for this instance. So you can see there are two languages for English and Spanish. Now I will try to enable other language, for example, German language. Let's see how to enable German language. Go to the plugins. After the plugins list loaded and type if you want to enable the language translations, okay, for which language you want to enable, type the language. For example, I need to enable German language, type German. Okay, so you can see there is a German translation plugin is available. So you can enable this, uh, enable German translations by clicking on install. And let's see. So when we click on install, then the internationalization, no, uh, knowledge management, internationalization plugin, or localization framework installer. So these all are dependent, if, but this is already currently installed. Okay. So you can activate by clicking on activate. Now to enable any language translations, it takes minimum three to four hours to complete it. Okay. Uh, let's wait for some time uh, and we'll see how the German language translations are enabled or not. After three to four hours, log in to your personal instance and check in the language picker, German language is enabled or not. Yeah, you can see that uh, German language is enabled. Okay, so in that way, you can install the language plugins for other languages. Please do subscribe to get alerts for upcoming videos. Hope you will enjoy and learn service now. Thank you very much for your time.